Instead of just cashing the money and giving it to me, man. Yep. You know? They they give you they give you up to three thousand dollars and then they then if you want more they they give you a cashier's check. Uh huh. You got to go somewhere else and cash it. Yeah. I remember. I think you told me a story just like that. Yep. I was, I went to give you all yeah, your money. Yeah. I took I took tried to take three thousand dollars out the bank and um they say they say well we can only give you I mean I tried to take over three thousand dollars out they said that we can only give you this amount and the rest <laughs> we have to give you in a check. Yeah. And you have to go to the bank next door and cash. Yep. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, I mean this place is going down though. I expect yeah. that sometimes. You know, I hey. Yeah. Okay. As long as I get it all. Yeah. Like as if, if uh you was gonna make a a, a big transaction, then it have to be digital. A digital transaction. Mm -hmm. Like, like by a, card a or card. something yep. like that. Yep. Yep. Yeah, this place is fucking going down, man. Good, man. Lord, Lord willing, it's everything speed up, though. We want this car. Lord, Lord willing, you know, that's that's what we looking for, man. We want, every, we want things to speed up, you know. You know, the scriptures say we're supposed to hasten the day, you know, of, of the Lord, man. You know, and then, and then, you know, like, a lot of times in your mind, like, being in the truth and knowing what's coming, Sometimes in your spirit, you get afraid, man. You be like, man, this stuff that's coming, it's going to be rough out here. You know, but you got to have, man, if you're a true man of the Lord, you got to have faith in, in you know, you got to have faith in the Lord to deliver you, man. That's why we go through things now. So we, when we go through bigger things, we have enough faith to say, well, the Lord brought me this far. You know, the Lord delivered me from that. He can deliver me from this, man. You know, a lot of times you go through you go through trials in the truth just to build up your faith, man. You know, cause we don't, man. We don't like like you know we don't just have a perfect spirit, man. Uh, you know, cause you know like the Lord, the Lord just now really starting to deal with us, man. In this last uh, uh, century or so, you know, last couple of centuries, you See, know. If we didn't have hell, we won't be um, purified, man. Yeah. We won't be. We won't. Um, we won't. Su if we won't suffer nothing, we won't be purified, man. Mm -hmm. You know, we need that pure. We need that purification, man. You know, yeah. to get all those that bad shit up out of us, man. Mm -hmm. The Lord got to drop sicknesses and hell on us, man. Yeah. You know, the trouble on us, so we can be perfected. Yeah, and humble, man. And humble, right. Right. And humble. Because a person that's humble, they ain't going to be for sure how, what's going to go on the next day or whatever. Yeah. Or, yeah. It, it, yeah. Make, it make you, when you humble, you have a better spirit towards the Lord, man. Yeah. You know, that, that's what I found out. Like, we be, be, having a humble spirit, it, and when Lord, it, it, it makes you lower yourself before the Lord, man. You know? And that's and we supposed to man. He, he got all he got all this power, man. How 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 would we not be humble, man? You know, but niggas, this is niggas that aren't humble at all, man. Don't have a humble spirit, man. We ain't got no power in this in this society. We don't have no power, man. The Lord is the Lord is is our power, and them niggas in the world ain't got no power. And they may see, like like the scriptures say, because because uh, judgment against the evil work is not is not uh, speedily. Uh, what is that? The scripture said. Judgment uh, against the evil work is not executed speedily. Uh, yeah, in the it's fully the set in the hearts of men to do evil, man. Yeah. yeah. Because people people do evil and, and they don't really see the the the, the, the uh, punishment for it, man. But that punishment is going to be you're not going to make it into the kingdom of heaven. You're going to die eventually. You're going to die. That's the punishment. Well, you're not going to just drop dead. You know, a lot of people a lot of people going, going to get these concentration camps and torture and rape. You know, it's going to be a, a lot of your death going to be prolonged, man. <laughs> mm -hmm. You know, it's too easy. Hey, it's too easy. It's, it's too it's. There are things worse than death, man. You know, death is easy. 
It's too easy for some of you, all the wickedness you've done to just die, man. Some of you gotta 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 live in agony for a couple of days, man. And when you and when you out here and you hurting and you suffering, man, <laughs> time drags time seem to drag real slow when you suffering. Yeah. <laughs> time drags, man. Yeah. Like I know like I like you know, like one time, you know, a while back, like some like some years back, man, I got locked up. You know? I got locked up and um I was only in there for one day, but it seemed like I was in there for a week, man. Because time, like when you when you catch a hell, man, time just drag, man. I, I even tried to go to sleep in a motherfucking jail, man. And it was only like a, an hour. <laughs> it felt like I was asleep for like seven hours, but it only an hour went by. Man. <laughs> You know, I was locked up because uh, my ass, I forgot to bring an ID to have my ass uh, uh, basically in the jail or whatever because I had no ID. They was talking about some, uh, and that's wicked as hell too, man. But still, you know, the Lord had me go through that. It wasn't when I was in the truth. That was when I was in the world. But, uh, <laughs> man, it was long, it was like a long fucking time, man. I was only in there for like eight hours. But it seemed like it was... Man, long ass. I felt like I was in there for like three days. Really. Yeah, and then you gotta see them other niggas that's in the jail, man. You gotta be in the same cell with a bunch of niggas, man. <laughs> this shit is crazy. Yeah, you be thinking, I might have to whoop somebody up in there. <laughs> Everybody, you in there with a bunch of niggas that's mad? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you thinking I'm gonna have to put my hands on somebody up in this place? <laughs> Lord willing, don't nobody try to come at me no no kind of way, you know? And then the fucking white man uh, give these old fucking thin ass fucking mattresses, <laughs> you know? You feel the fucking steel, man. That blanket be like a handkerchief. Yeah, man. Be old old dirty, me. dirty wool bl uh, blanket, man. If it be wool, probably be some other, probably be uh, fucking dog hair or something, man. Get it together, you know? This fucking white man is the devil. He's a wicked man. You know? And, uh, and, uh, <laughs> these fucking people, they at home right now, man, watching the fucking Super Bowl, man. They're not concerned about uh, this place going down. You know? We're probably in a fucking halftime right now. Yeah. Taking a fucking break. Yeah. The so halftime is the time that I come in to watch. That's the time. <laughs> hey, halftime on yet? Uh -huh. Everybody else be leaving. Oh, I can go piss now. Niggas be holding their piss to watch the Super Bowl. Yeah. Yeah. Halftime is the time that I'll be waiting on. Hey, halftime, halftime about to come on. You know, that's because I'm seeing what they, what demonic shit they're going to do, man. Like last year when they made that baffle mat sign with Beyonce and our yeah. dance team. The yeah. big ass, they was dancing on a big baffle mat head, man. Yeah. They had that bitch dressed like a monster, man. She was like a damn demon, man. Yeah. A fucking demon. They slowed the camera down and demons was coming inside of her. <laughs> she flipped her head back like that and a demon came inside of her, man. You know, they got that, they got that on, 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 uh, YouTube, man. And it's gonna be more demons this year, man. Lord willing, that a halftime, a uh, fucking pocket nuke go off. And there be body parts everywhere, man. <laughs> <laughs> Fingers flying in people's mailboxes. Uh-huh. You know? Uh -huh. <laughs> man, we need, man, we looking for something to happen, man. Yeah. These devils, man, they've been, they've been, been, they've been some good devils, man. They ain't been fucking up people like that. The Lord been jacking people up. Just, you know, this weather been fucking people up. Yeah. yeah. Weather, this, these uh, diseases out here, illnesses. Yeah. You know, people in people in Atlanta was it uh, was getting stuck in their cars, freezing, man. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
getting stuck, man. And it only got like a few inches of snow. Yeah. That's the Lord, man. Places where it really don't supposed to snow like that, man. Getting snow. We in the end times, man. Yeah. And that little had a few inches of snow fucked them people up, man. And the, really, the Lord had it where, to them, that few inches was like a fucking mm -hmm. uh, 24 inches of snow, man. So it's like they was in some kind of, they was like literally, man, like an emergency, man. Yeah, it's an emergency. And they ain't had no salt trucks. Yeah. <laughs> The, yeah. the city, they, they ain't had no salt trucks, so people just out there slipping and sliding in ditches. Yeah. You know, they, then they was finding people in their car with hypothermia, people damn near froze, people froze. <laughs> you know? Yeah. You know, you slide in the ditch and, your, and, your, and your, uh, your car go off, you get knocked out. You know? You won't, you won't, you won't yeah. mess around and go in the shot while you're knocked out and freeze to death. You know, the Lord been jacking people up, man. Man, hopefully the Lord, man, destroy this place, man, real soon in this year, man. That's all I can ask the Lord. And, you know, in the name of y'all, watch me on shower, man. Just, just put this place to a close, man. I'm tired of this fucking place. You know? And you fucking at least get off your ass, man. Go ahead and bring, bring your new world order. Because it's going to get, it's going to get. Uh, um, it's gonna get canceled. Yeah. All right, your new order gonna, plan gonna get canceled. Man. It's gonna be an upset. You got a short time. You know? So with that, I'm gonna say uh, I'll praise the Yahweh by some outside double honors to I elders, the great millstone. You know, so love, love to the brothers that's out there on the highways and byways. You know, preaching the sincerity of this truth. You know, of the Lord, man. You know, so with that, shalom. Thank you.